So to answer this conclusively, is this a big cat in the UK? Yes or no? My answer is going to be all right everyone how are we all doing welcome along back to a brand new video and today we're here in the beautiful part of warwickshire at a place called the saxon mill and it's right next to another place called guys cliff we're here for is this a big cat in the uk another one we've had another one and you've all sent it to me again so we're going to talk about it here today but first i need to get across to you how beautiful of a place this is and also I'm trying to find some kingfishers. So enjoy this drone footage. We enjoyed that and i hope you now gain an appreciation for where i am just over there is the guy's cliff but as i've walked around here and i'm on the search for kingfishers i haven't found any but right there and all the way down there people swimming <laughs> it's about eight degrees out here and they're in the water having a swim so that's my chances of kingfishers in this area completely gone out the window which is a bit annoying there's nothing i can do about that i'm not going to shout them get out of water that's not gonna happen there's gonna be no kingfishers at this bit i need to go back up there towards where the pub is and see if i can see something around there but oh well what can you do I've just come back to the pub. You might hear the weird behind me, it's very loud. But right here, you won't be able to see it very well. There is a kingfisher and it's just popped out from here as some dogs went over the bridge. It's made a squeak on all the way over there. And I can just see the bright blue spark on its back. I can't get any closer, unfortunately. I can't go over to that bit, but it's right away off there. And just a little tiny, tiny blob. Um, but there is a kingfisher, so I'm quite happy like, I can see it, but ultimately I need it to come back this way. So no more from the Saxon Mill, the Guy's Cliff area. So I've come down to another area which should have kingfishers, hopefully anyway. We're getting later on in the day and we might get one just over there. There's an overhanging branch which the kingfishers usually go to. So it, we could get lucky, you never know. I've moved to a location that's got a bit of seclusion. It should be nice and quiet, no weirs or anything like that. And we could talk about the main topic of today's video, which is this, a big cat in the UK. Again, you guys have sent me this quite a lot and have asked me, Cookie, is this a big cat? Yeah, make of that what you will. Do you think that is a big cat? Get your comment in the comment section down below. So to talk about this plain and simply, it's a cat in some sort of like new build residential area on top of like a ridge or sort of like a hill that's been, I, I suppose man-made, I don't know, but it's there and it walks across and you can see it move side on. It's quite a good view of whatever this animal is, albeit it's quite far away. Flipping plane, we did. And another thing as well, there is no sound to the video, which which always in my book is never a good sign. If this was recorded on a phone, uh, it's probably not a good look, is it? Quite simply, your phones record sound. So why isn't there sound on it? It's from Facebook. That's where it's been posted in some like Welsh thing. And it seems like this construction worker has seen his cat and he's thought, I'll film that with my phone. And I guess without the sound, it's uh, quite a bit more 
interesting than what it would be with the sound. So firstly, let's actually take a look at this animal. Now you can see it side on. Does it look quite big? I mean, yes and no. So we can see its tail as well. Its tail looks relatively like a normal size. Now the thing about the tails is usually with like a, a big cat, like a leopard or a jaguar, they've got these really, really long tails. One thing you're looking for with a big cat like this, usually the tails like are dead straight out like that, but they have a big hook in them as well. With this one, you can see there isn't a big long tail. It, I mean, it looks, it doesn't even look long really. So the first thing for me, right, is the tail isn't right to be a leopard or a jaguar. Now, if we move it onto the head, it's got pointy ears, which, Jaguars and leopards don't have, more rounded. And also the head shape's just not right. It just isn't. And as well, the body, it looks fluffy. I can't lie, it does look quite fluffy. Now, there are only two options what this animal could be. It's black, so you've got black leopard or black jaguar. It's neither of those. Black leopards and black jaguars aren't fluffy. They're short-haired, and you would see that in this video. If it was a real black leopard, if it was a real black jaguar, you would see a very muscular, built animal with no fluff. This animal we're seeing in this video is fluffy. But not only that, the way it walks as well. So a little domestic cat, they sort of walk like sort of fast paced really. It's a weird one. They look like they're moving slowly, but their legs sort of walk faster. Whereas a black leopard or just a jaguar leopard, whatever, they, they are very much more composed. They sort of plod. They're just calculated with what they do. They're really casual. They know they're the big dog of the territory and they would just mooch about. This thing isn't mooching. This thing's like proper got a little fast walk on. So that is another thing as well I'd look at and think, yeah, that ain't that ain't a big cut. So this picture is obviously doing the rounds and I logged into my burner Facebook account to get into these uh, big cat groups that I've been kicked out of. And I looked for the posts that had this in and there's quite a few and there's quite a few that People believe that this is a big cat. So we've got one here, one of the better big cat videos. Certainly looks like a big cat and not a domestic cat, great video. And then there's a really long comment from the admin of one of these pages saying, yeah, it looks like a big cat. And then you've got a few more on TikTok, which just say, yeah, that's definitely not a house cat. This could be the most convincing one I've ever seen so far. And I find that baffling. And I sort of look at that and think, have you guys ever seen a leopard? Have you ever seen a jaguar? Because they don't, they don't look like that. They don't walk like that. They just look nothing like that. Now, I don't know if it's the colour black. I don't know if the colour black is playing a perception game with people here. When this phone zooms in, it looks way bigger than what it actually is. I would, I would just guess this is a normal standard black cat, just a domestic house cat. But because the way the phone zooms in and because of the colour black, I'm sort of, I'm sort of looking at this thinking, is, it, is there some sort of like trickery going on here with like the way our brains perceive the color black? Because it doesn't look anything like a black leopard or a black jaguar. And I find it really confusing when people sort of look at it and go, best proof ever. Like jaguars and leopards, they're not fluffy. That thing's fluffy. Just, that, that's it really, isn't it? And the head doesn't even look the same. I really don't get it. So to answer this conclusively, is this a big cat in the UK? Yes or no? My answer is going to be no, guys. It's quite clearly a domestic cat once again and i'm still waiting for the day we get one of these videos or pictures where we can i can sort of stand here and go that is a flipping big cat but today is not going to be that day what do you think in the comment section down below do you agree is this a domestic cat in the uk or do you think this is actually a big cat that someone's recorded with no sound in wales or wherever it is for now though go check out the website get yourself a hoodie or a t-shirt we've got limited stock so make sure you're quick over there I've been Cookie, I will see you in the next video. I hope you enjoyed the Kingfisher footage. So happy to get some really good footage for you there. Send me your videos that you want me to review and I'll have a look at them. And I think I'll see you in the next one. All right, take care, bye.